Hey, Dave here. We've got a 2016 Sea-Doo Spark with a 90 Rotax HO, 90 horsepower on this one. And I just took the water pump off and the water pump was blowing a little bit of water on top of the, um, what is that, a cam tower there, right below the oil cooler. And it was dripping down the side by the uh, oil filter um, in there. So no cracks were in the block. We made sure that there was glycol in here. So when it was brought in, you know, it was uh, no water. So we didn't have to worry about a crack block. Uh, but what happened is, here's the water pump. The water pump goes on the face of the block. And Sea-Doo has a parts change where they have black gaskets and green gaskets. And these gaskets go around in a groove inside of the uh, water pump here. And it's just a plastic water pump, super lightweight. But the green gasket is a half a millimeter, 0.5 millimeters wider than the black one. You can see there's an extra rib there. So if you're getting leaks on these Sea-Doo's, pull off the pump, whether it's the water pump there or the oil cooler and see if you have the black gaskets. I've got another video that shows the process for the um, um, oil cooler, but uh, here's the part number, 420-431-682. The original part number is 680, and with c the last digits, either um, a zero is OEM, original, and then a one or a two are the superseded parts, and that's what you need. So we're gonna put this gasket in, bolt it all up, and we shouldn't have the blow-by of the antifreeze, which is starting to make a nice, uh, reaction with the aluminum there. All right, I'm Gadget Guy Dave Matthews with another Sea-Doo Repair.